Hi, my name is Omar Noor, and I'm the first Egyptian professional triathlete in history. But I wasn't always an athlete, and um, I wasn't always athletic, period, actually. My story starts in Egypt. I was born in Cairo, Egypt, and my family and I, we moved as a family to Switzerland, and we lived there for like 11 years. That's where my childhood was. And then we moved from Switzerland to the United States, to uh, Washington, D.C., basically. And um, I always wanted to be a doctor. My uncle is a doctor, an ear, nose, and throat surgeon, so I wanted to be an ear, nose, and throat surgeon. So once I was in, um, in D.C., etc., I started to study really hard in high school and work towards getting into a good university for medicine. And I went, got accepted into Johns Hopkins University and went to Johns Hopkins University for my pre-med career. So now, you know, when you want to be a doctor, your parents don't really question it too much. Our son wants to be a doctor, let's encourage him, go for it, right? Well, after the four years of pre-med, I decided, you know what? Not sure, I just want to continue to the medical track. I want to try to find myself. I want to figure out who I am, etc. I fully expected my parents to bring out the guillotine and, and just finish me off right there. But I was uh, very surprised and I'm actually very, very grateful that both of them were like, you know what, listen, don't do anything for us, do it for yourself. Because uh, you're going to live your entire life doing what you choose to do today. And so the journey began where I started to start businesses. <laughs> it's my entrepreneurship years. At age 21, I started my first uh, business and it failed pretty miserably. Started to work, went into the working world, etc. And then my brother and I started our last uh, venture uh, together about seven years ago. It was a time when the economy was doing really well in the US and we owned a condo together in DC. So we took all the equity out of our condo and pumped it into the business. And the idea was, you know what? We don't want to owe anything to anybody. If we succeed, we owe it to each other. But if we failed, we'd be jobless and homeless. So the risk was really, really high. And so with that, some of, of you listening to this right now, maybe you can relate to some of this. Long hours, super long hours at work, not sleeping uh, good nights, not eating healthy foods, eating late at night, um, stress, all these things, no time to work out, all these things started to accumulate, accumulate, accumulate. And slowly, we just started to put on pounds, pounds, kilos, pounds, kilos, until all of a sudden I was 105 kilos. 